Hotter. Mm -hmm. The Big Three Basketball League is bringing the heat and changing the game for its biggest season yet. From the beginning, Big Three has changed the game. Win, and it's over. We've never been afraid to make some wins. After all, diversity is what we're built on. Two women head coaches have won championship titles. Well, some of the greatest athletes are stepping on the court for season six of the three on three basketball league with big name matchups and even bigger rebounds. Uh huh. Rapper, actor, and founder of Big Three, Ice Cube, joining us now live this morning with the scoop. Hello and welcome to New York Living. Hey, how y'all doing? We're better for talking to you. Fantastic now that you're here. Okay, yeah. So let's, can we get into it? Big changes are coming to Big Three. We hear you are heading out of the country. Oh, yeah, for our championship. Um, we're doing our championship this year and our all-star game in London at the O2 Arena. Very exciting. You know, basketball is one of those sports that, that translates globally, uh, like boxing or MMA or soccer. So to, and, and we have fans all over the world. You know, the big three is shown in over 40 countries. Mm -hmm. So... It's great to be able to start to, to go international with the league. Love it. And, and speaking of the league, league kudos, by yes. the way, for bringing in Lisa Leslie, a woman, into the, into the game here. Very important. So, you know, you mentioned how it's all over the world. So for the uninitiated, we wonder if you might be able to tell us what makes Big Three different than a the, traditional yeah. basketball game, traditional I guess game. you could say. Well... Uh, you know, three on three has always been like the little cousin of five mm, on five right. full court. So three on three has, you know, something that's played all through the country. Um, and so to, to elevate it to the professional level, you know, the difference are, you know, we play on half court. So there's one basket, um, three, three players on the court uh, versus each other. And hey, you know, it's, it's, it's still a fast-paced game. Um, we got cool rules that make our game a little more unique than, mm -hmm. than NBA. You know, we got four-point shots. Not the four-point um, shots. Which <laughs> is great. It, yeah, yeah. You know, so these are, these are little wrinkles that's great. Um, so, you know, it, it's the three-on-three -three that, that we all grew up playing but uh -huh. just elevated to the professional level. Did you ever play basketball when you were a kid? And if so, which position did you dominate? Yeah, I played as a kid. I played for the uh, Inglewood YMCA as a Hold youngster. Inglewood was a point Cal guard. Oh, man. I got real excited for a second. Girl got really excited. She thought she were playing in her neighborhood. Inglewood, California. <laughs> All right. Inglewood, okay. California with an eye. <laughs> yeah, so, so, um... Yeah, you know, it was, a, it was a fun experience as a youngster. I played when I was like 11, mm -hmm. 12, and 13. And so, um, you know, I've always had fun with the game. Um, you know, I definitely knew that, you know, I should definitely get into music and rap <laughs> uh, and, and, and movies. But, but at the end of the day, I'm still a fan of the game. And, and to have a league like this and to be able to come to, to, to Brooklyn with the game that's you know, right. we're out there, uh, yeah, July 9th. And um, it's going to be great because we're going to be celebrating mm -hmm. the 50th anniversary of hip-hop as well. Yes. So you're going to have some great, some great big three That's fireball right. as well as great entertainment. And it's going to be a fun night. So you, are, you, are you playing at the Barclays? At the Barclays Center? Yes, we're playing at the Barclays. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Barclays Center in Brooklyn. It's our third time. Um, coming to Brooklyn, maybe our fourth time. Okay. And so it's pretty cool to, to be back. You know, we know the fans are going to be hyped. You know, they love Big Three. Nothing and so, like, uh, like you know, Brooklyn we can't wait. There's nothing like it. Brooklyn, you, we you go hard. You mentioned you didn't stick with ball. You, you stuck to music. You stuck to movies. Hip-hop. So you'll be in Brooklyn across the river at the end of August. Hip-hop turns 50 at Yankee Stadium. What, has, yeah. what does this mean for yeah. you? I've been listening to podcasts, and people always give you your props for your impact on the hip-hop culture, on the music, on the community. What does this mean for you? And can we get backstage with you? Uh-huh. Oh, thank you for asking. 
Come on, you know, I, I know a few people. I, I definitely think I could sneak y'all backstage. But uh, it's amazing to be able to, to do Yankee Stadium. Yes. Um, for one, it's iconic. Um, you know, this is one of those bucket list moments for me. Um, and then to be in the Bronx the celebrating Bronx, the 50th of, anniversary. You, huh? Birthplace of hip hop. Excuse me? Yeah, the birthplace of hip hop. To be there on that night uh, with, with all those iconic groups, you know, Run DMC's last show, um, you know, I couldn't ask for anything more as an artist and as a fan, you know, because, you know, when I'm not performing, I'm going to definitely be in those seats <laughs> checking everybody else out. Front so uh, it's going to be a fun favorites. night. Oh, I love it. Thank you so, so much for being here. Congratulations and continued success on all of it, all the, the sportiness, and the performance. So okay. be sure to grab your tickets to the Big Three at Barclay Center. It's at big3.com. Thanks so much. Thanks, Ice. Thank you. I appreciate it.